Strange. Hello everybody, Tom here from The Company Code. I hope you're all well today. Today we're going to discuss the age-old argument about people being odd. They say that there are no queerer than folk. And just to clarify, that's not a homophobic slur. I mean queer as in odd. You know, as in like not a bit weird, yeah? Absolutely. I 100% have come to realise this, the older I have got, the more I've met people from all different walks of life. The fact of the matter is, every single human being on the planet has their own ways, their own quirks, their own ways of doing things, their own opinions, and what we could probably refer to as foibles, the little things that we all do. And from one person to the next... The other person will find it odd. One thing I have never ever agreed with is when somebody calls me weird. And I've been called weird many a time in my life. To be called weird is an opinion that that other person has formed of you. And everybody has a right to have their own opinion. And absolutely, your opinion is as individual as the nose on your face. Okay? There's a, another phrase I could use which is a little bit harsh. I'm not going to go there. But anyway, quite simply, people are people and people are odd. People are strange. They've got the strange little ways. They've got their own ways of doing things. They've got our own opinions. It's what makes life interesting, I think. But yet we all sometimes find ourselves ridiculing somebody for being different. We strike them out and accuse them of being odd and peculiar and strange and weird. I don't subscribe to that, as I said. People have called me weird over the years. And perhaps I do things that they wouldn't even consider normal. And that's fine. You know why that's fine? Because it's, that, it's my right to be different. And it's my right to be myself. And it's my right to do things that may not sit with you. Because at the end of the day, there are going to be other people out there that are the same to me. I don't agree with what they do. I don't agree with the way they act. I don't agree that what they do is normal. You know, I'm a hundred going to be really, really hundred percent straight with you here. I don't think social media is a normal thing. I really don't. All right, some would say it's hypocritical. You're on a form of social media in YouTube. You're on Instagram. Yes, I am. But am I posting every five minutes what I've eaten? Am I going on about where I've been and what I've done all the time? Absolutely not. I'm too busy living life to give a damn about all that. But there are people literally out there documenting everything they do now to me that's weird that's weird because you're not living in the moment and you're not doing you're not enjoying life you're more interested in the photograph or the picture or the video than you are what you're actually meant to be enjoying that's not to me that's not right that's not normal but again that's people for you everybody so there are lots of people that think that's that's perfectly okay and that's fine and some people it's about sharing the memory or capturing the memory. Perhaps they've concerned that they're going to forget it. Maybe it's just this disposable society that we live in where everything is so throwaway that if it's not recorded or it's not documented or there's no video or photograph of it, it didn't happen. Or well, some would say it didn't happen. And some would absolutely be adamant that it didn't happen. But that to me is strange. That's strange, being so precious about recording everything and taking photos of everything and taking selfies every two minutes. That, to me, is weird. But then there will be others that would say going on YouTube and recording videos is weird. Horses for courses, to each their own. You know, that's the way I look at it and that's how the way I look at life and it's the way I look at other people and their ways of going about things at the end of the day you're all free to do as you please as long as you don't hurt anybody and you don't infringe on anyone's happiness there is no issue at all and that's the way i look at it okay you have the right to be yourself 
you have the right to have your own little ways. You have your right to irritate another person with them or make them think you're strange. But don't ridicule somebody to the point where you're getting too personal, okay? Everybody is an individual and has the right to do the individual things they want to do. If the next person thinks it's strange or weird, that's their opinion and that's theirs to keep. Don't change who you are and be who you are, even if that person is quirky or that part of you is quirky and that person doesn't like it. You have the right to be strange. Strange to anybody and to everybody. Stand by it, be yourself. And that's the message here today. People will say you're strange. You may be strange to others, but to somebody you'll probably make sense as well. That's life, that's the world, and that's the modern age. Guys, third and final video of the week. I want to say thank you all ever so much for listening. I really appreciate your time and energy spent here on my channel. Thank you kindly. Third and final video, as I said, put down in the comment section below. Have ever, people ever accused you of being weird or strange or odd or quirky? Uh, does it really matter that somebody thinks you are? That's fine. It really is. That's fine at the end of the day, of course. Let them think it. Let them think whatever they want. Because at the end of the day, people will think what they want. They will say what they want. They will judge. That is just how it is. That is one thing that is certain. You will get judged and you will get laughed at, ridiculed for being different and told you, you're not conforming to their standards, therefore you are strange. Let it go over your head, because I do. There have been a time when I used to worry about it, but not anymore. Remember, remember to hit that subscribe button down below. Leave me a thumbs up and a like and let's hear that bell go, sign go ding dong so you know my next content's out. Guys, we'll be back next week with another three videos, but until then... Thank you all ever so much as always for listening. I really appreciate your time and energy spent in my channel. Back in a couple of days with the next batch. Till then, take care of yourselves and bye for now.